Praise the Lord Jesus and a pleasant Tuesday morning to you, my friends. Amen. We are indeed blessed and highly favored by God. It's a blessing to be alive and well and clothed in our right minds and have the activity of our limbs. Amen. Welcome to another day's devotion. This morning's scripture is coming from 1 Timothy 6 and verse 6. But godliness with contentment is great gain amen praise god so godliness my friend with contentment is great gain praise god amen once you are living a life that brings glory to god amen you have all right amen to be content in that my friend if all that you do is live your life to please the lord amen praise god and everything else will be okay amen because remember godliness with contentment is a great gain and when you are living a godly life praise god living to please the lord and not man or not the devil amen once you are living to please god automatically amen praise god others will have to be at peace with you because the scripture said when a man's ways please the lord even his enemy will be at peace with him amen so be contented in the fact that the life that you live brings glory to god amen continue to walk in the spirit so that the flesh will not be gratified continue to feast upon the words of the lord continue to fast continue to pray continue to trust and obey continue to look to the hills from whence cometh your help my help our help cometh from the lord godliness with contentment is great gain so you might not have all the things that you need in this life praise god but if you are living a godly life my friend you are rich in spiritual blessings praise god and the scripture said that where your treasure is there also your heart will be so store up treasures my friend the scripture said not on earth where moth and rust you know come and corrupt and rotten them down and get them you know deteriorated and and so forth and you lose them for everything in this life is only for a time but the scripture said to store up your treasures in heaven we are neither moth nor rust doeth corrupt praise god so i just want to encourage you to be content in the fact that your life please god and that your life brings glory to god because godliness with contentment is great gain praise god so you might not be at a place where you might want to be but let, don't let that discourage you praise god the fact that you continues to live a godly life praise god god will reward you at the appointed time in jesus name because godliness with contentment is a great gain let us pray father we humble ourselves under your mighty hand. We thank you, God Almighty, for where you have us right now. Because where we are is where we need to be. Praise God. You have, uh, oh God Almighty, your time to do whatsoever you would have, uh, you would do. Praise God. So help us to be patient with the process. Knowing that, God, once we are living a godly life, God, it is what brings glory to your name. It is what blesses you, God Almighty. It is what, uh, amen, brings you the glory help us god not to get weary in well-doing but to keep marching toward the mark of the high calling of god in christ jesus and to live a life that is pleasing to you godly life praise god and even when the attacks come and the situations the problems come left right and center help us not to turn to the right hand or to the left but help us to remember the scripture that said the man that will live godly will suffer persecution praise god we thank you for hearing for answering prayers amen and for your will that is being done in our lives in jesus name we pray amen if you believe it type in the box lord help me to continue to live a godly life so that you can get the glory put it in the box and share to bless others